So yes, finally, finally, finally. So of course, we are back with another Digging Battle video. I forgot about this. I completely, utterly forgot about this. So today we did get a new, of course, LR campaign and LR. Um, the B-Pad right here. Um, these you can use are actually really probably the easiest ones you can get. And all the easy units that we had, April Fool's units, the Halloween units from last year. Really, really, really easy. I utterly forgot to do this video. I was like, oh my gosh. I was, I was like, I was like, did something else come up for JP, maybe? I, mean, I was just looking for some, like, some, I forgot. I, I, I think I just, I was on, like, the Dokken Wiki just looking. I was like, oh my gosh. I was like, B-Pad are easy. Hey, I was like, I need to do a video on this because I completely nearly forgot to talk about them, go over them. Um, I know a lot of people, other people don't really do it. I like to do it myself. That kind of talk about it and go over it. Maybe for JP, then Global, I can do gameplay because I'm not going to make a JP account. I'd rather stay on Global. I don't care what you people say out there. I say about what? Whatever, your opinions don't matter. I'm kidding. I'm, I'm just kidding, though, by the way. I don't mean that. You guys' opinions do matter. The other side's like, they really don't. Get rid of them. Get rid of the fan base. Cut it all. I'm kidding. So, yeah. Um, really, really easy to go through, though, of course, for the units, because they're all the easy units we got into, like, this last year, so, Halloween from last year, um, units, um, of course, April Fool's units, of course, and again, all April Fool's units are on here, slash, you know, Halloween units, because Gotenks, um, no, because Candy Vegito, Gotenks, and Goten, Grandpa Gohan, and Pan, they're all Halloween units, and, um, yeah, because, yeah, because they're all Halloween units, yeah, all the Halloween units plus the April Fool's units, so... Yeah, the what if you use the Dokken, so yeah. Um, they're actually gonna be really easy because they all have oh, their own easy areas, their own events where you get them. They all have, all have easy A's. They're all actually really, really easy. The events come back, not as often, but all the events are probably back right now. So again, not gonna take that much. For easy, easy A'ing them might do a lot. Well, actually, no, because frequently easy A's, I don't think take that much as any as regular easy A's. I believe they don't. I don't know, it's been a really good long minute though, so um. Yeah, they don't, I don't think they take as much because they are free to play. A regular easy aim just take a lot of any though, but I think these guys won't take as much. That's probably going to be your only really big problem because otherwise, these are all free to play units. You can get any time, any day almost. Especially with the keys nowadays, you can easily do that, but I, again, I get keys because, you know, you don't want to use them as much. But yeah, though, like, you really... They're actually really easy to get. Like, you get them all. They all don't use the area, which are all into one now. So, um, you can do all those separately. Um, probably the only problem is just, like, all the units you use for the, for the easy A's. It probably won't be as big as much as a lot of other people will probably think of it. But overall, though, I feel like it's going to be actually really easy to get these guys. They're all free to play units. You can farm at any time, any day of the week. So, it doesn't really matter. So, yeah. Um, of course, though, then we got another easy A. Um, of course, um, her main easy A right here, of course. I'm going over that. Um, so yeah, this one actually should be really, I think you only do it once a week, though. That's a rip, though, because you only do it once a week. So yeah, that's a real rip right there. I think I saw the info. I saw the truth video title. I was like, wait, what? I was like, I gotta see that video title, my dude. Um, so yeah. Um, we got that, and of course, we got Gears Easy as well, which kind of came up out of nowhere, too. I was like, okay, that's good, though. Again, we got, like, what? How many Easy A's? Uh, one, two, because they knew I'm gone. Because, again, before the Easy A area, before they get, like, a big Easy A campaign, they do Easy A two units or waking two units and waking them or whatever. So, yeah. And Gears his Easy A just came out of nowhere. It's, again, it's any GT unit, basically, for this guy. Um, I think he's actually really good, though. Um, for, like, I think he's, like, official Dragon Ball, like, you know, um, Dragon Ball Seeker's leader, I believe. So if you have no other options, if you didn't farm out like um, I think Goku and Rally, I think they're like one of the leaders. Um, and them, um, if you haven't farmed out them, which well, I was only doing like what now two years now. Um, yeah, I can remember grinding out Goku. I was in high school. I was in my um, class. So yeah, um, yeah, though we did see it though. Because um, I was in high school, I think I was on um, farming out. Um, I remember the day Goku came out, like his SSR or T or whatever. I did actually farm that, so I remember that. That grind was crazy. So. The ground was really insane. So, yeah, that. Um, of course, then we got another easy area, of course, for these units right here, though. Um, I don't really need to, like, really go over that, though. But, yeah. And the other easy A, so it should be honestly really, really, really easy to go through these guys. So, yeah. Again, it's basically, though, it's, again, these are all just really simple, really easy stuff to go through, though. So, I don't really need to explain that much. Unless you know whatever, because that's what I'm here. Um, for JP, I'm going to do a computer guide. For global, I usually do mobile guides. So, yeah. Of course, easy area, really, really, probably should be really easy. I know that myself for global. It should be honestly really easy for you guys, though. Again, again, the only big problem is that not everybody's gonna have all these units down here. Like, not everybody's gonna be pan ready because, again, it does take a long time to get the LR anyway. Um, Kitty Vegito, again, not everybody's gonna have those units, though, or, you know, like Grey Salmon, Goten, um, Trunks, I'm gonna say. I mean, that can also be a thing. You know, Goten's Grey Salmon. So, there you go, Doki, another what if. Um, but yeah, again, the units you can use here are actually pretty solid, though. I've used it myself. The Goten's right there is the best leader, probably. Um, Oh, okay. I know the leader. Okay, use the leader because I think that Goten's only use. Um, 
Yeah, it turns out only you have sacred. I, I don't know why I did that um, in my head. So of course for left path you get times two bronze, three um two to three bronze. Uh, right path gives you silver. Um, and of course you get the question mark chances. It's five bronze or fourteen silver. Super path is basically the same thing, but you get gold for left path. Um, times two, five gold, and of course times two for the path. Um, you get you get, you get it twice essentially. Uh, you get five rainbow. Uh, chance of a rainbow is gold or um hundred oh, no hundred. I was having the same gold or rainbow. I was like that you don't even need it. You're already done. So, yeah. First age you had the required units you had to use because the units are required to use for the easy area, which makes sense obviously. Um, candy Vegeta for the first one, the first and second stage of course is candy Vegeta and Ghost Go tanks. The third first stage, stage three to four, you had to use um a big Ghost or Vegeta or Plutonium battle units. And of course, through the stages, um, you, had, you had to have them both on the same team as well. Um, Great Sam and Trunks, and of course, Grip on Gohan. Again, all these units are all pretty good, though, actually. I have to actually use them myself. Um, Candy Vegito, um, Tech Vegito right there. I haven't really used this Vegito. Go Ghost Gotenks actually really good. B Pan did some really good damage, healed me up a lot. A Big Goku, a Big Vegito actually do a lot of damage. Um, I haven't used this um, Gotenks right here. I think it's only mainly useful for fighting two more enemies, though. So yeah, again, you guys are required to actually have the easy area. Um, I never seen this pin as much. She probably is going to be a really good support unit you know, on there because you have your allies for attack defense plus twenty percent for all your allies. Um, again, these eight big Goku and eight big Vegeta equally though they're going to be actually really good besides the fan stage, but overall they're going to actually do some really good output damage. The units you use here are actually all really good. I've used them myself. Again, I've talked from experience. I've played this game thousands of times. So yeah. Um, but yeah, though, to be honestly, really, really easy to go through for this. Like, this actually should be really, really easy and good. Uh, I think Giru is right here as well, I believe. Uh, the GT edition, of course, for Giru. Um, again, any GT unit is again the same easy area. I have the same rules and stuff like that, so nothing really down here really has changed. But the thing is, I use any GT units, which are all okay though. Again, they're not gonna hit as hard, but they're actually gonna be really useful together. So they're all gonna have pretty much GT or prepare for battle or shocking speed maybe but yeah um some gt bosses some gt heroes um again that's a new category you could probably sum it up and do it there uh, but honestly be really easy there again some of these guys can be hidden gems like the baby right here super baby two right here or baby one baby one he could probably be a hidden gem supposed to have units on um, club be a hidden gem here but mainly it's physical though so you use like nova right here this goku is actually really really good i don't care what anybody says he's actually is really good the units are basically the ones you want to use for this event and stuff like that but it's more really easy again you got a lot of good people in here like the super saiyan 2 gt goku is physical um, you have Nova Shimmer, of course, physical Frieza. Yeah, you got a lot of good physical units on here. Just mix and match some units and stuff like that. Physical Omega, he'll probably get his ETA. Probably next after these guys because it makes sense. GT plus, I think he was next in the line to get his um, EZA and stuff like that, according to Truth. Um, I believe him though because I think. Yeah, because it's Blue Goku then him. Yeah, okay, yeah. Um, same again. All these areas are all pretty much the same though. Same path, same everything. So I don't really need to go over and explain that pretty much. So yeah. Um, next one right here is of course B Pans. It actually one should be really really easy too. It's where Goku's the leader again. They always make the opposite typing the leader, which was really stupid. Like seriously. Um, makes sense I think because no Vegeta wasn't. It was the Trunks. So yeah. Again, you get five medals. I think you get um, up to two gold drops. It'll be five medals. Again, you only do this once a week. So. Yeah, again, make sure to do it uh, like probably like now or whenever you get the chance because if you miss out on it, like the B Pan event, um, that one you can do once a week. Whatever day you do it, like uh, Monday, Friday, Wednesday, whatever, it will come back on that day. Like, for example, if I did today, time of recording, it is Saturday, um, for me, uh, May 1st, 2021. Um, if I did it right now. Yeah, I would, I would have to wait a week, literally a week t later today, like literally a week next Saturday to do it. So yeah, it does, this is how it kind of works. So, so you do have to kind of be, um, just make sure you always do it no matter what, because yeah, you, you can't actually miss out on it and stuff like that. It's like the B Pen event and the Weiss event where it came back and permanently, and you could just infinitely farm equipment just, you know, doing it on that one day. So again, the easy air units are actually really, really easy to get this time around though. So yeah. Of course, up. Now it's time to get in units because I never actually really broke them down or just kind of break them down or whatever. So Giru got a, got a really good awakening. So he does um, Dragon Ball Seekers um, category key three, everything up 77% or int type key three, um, everything up 50%. Raises attack defense for one turn, spoof damage, steals enemy. Um, to think, I'm sorry, I, I was looking at something on the side there. Um, I my hair. Um, yeah. Uh, I'll, I'll, I can like have like a second piece. Attack defense plus 70%, two key and attack defense plus 70, another attack defense plus 70%. Um, high chance of evading enemies attack, including super attacks. If there's a hyper sane um, ally on the team, Dragon Ball Secure category allies get key three attack defense um, 40%. Really good balance though, of course. Good support type. Again, if you have a hyper sane, which makes sense on the team as a pan. Um, any, again, any hyper sane on the team can actually be really good. Which you can actually put B pan on there, you can put Go Chen Trunk on there um, for the Broly movie, the second coming Broly movie. Um, 
Yeah, again, you have a lot of pretty good options on the team. So again, you're gonna have hyper things mixed up in there anyway. However, whenever, however, you're gonna do it. And Dragon Ball Secret, of course, allies are gonna be on the team because if you want a whole Dragon Ball Secret team, you're gonna infinitely get that key three attack defense plus on um, 140. And of course, um. For Hyper Saiyans, of course, it's going to be really good as well. So, yeah, League of the Categories don't change that much, but, yeah. He has GD Heroes because he's, like, one of the new GT, you know, not new, but, like, um, new category additions for GT Heroes because, you know, that category is new. I'm really good with Gear, though. He actually this seems really, really good, though. Of course, we have, um, Grandpa Gohan Pan, Coming Hot Category Key 3. I, mean, I think they all have the same, pretty much, their skill, though, but I think they have Coming Hot Key 3, everything up 77%. OSDR Type Key 3, everything up 50%. To raise attack defense for one turn, speed damage um, to enemy. Uh, attack was 100% performing a super attack, and a great chance of doing another, um, of course, um, another, of, of another 100% um, attack and defense plus 50% if, you no, know, with each super attack performed of 100%. Dang, that's insane. I think before it was like 70 or 80. Really, really good though. Um, key 3 plus attack defense um, 50% when there is um, another Goku family category ally attacking at the same turn. Recovers can HP of candy, which we've seen already with these units. Um, you know, the um, you know, co candy gimmick with these Maji Blue Vans or just whatever in general. These categories don't change that much though, of course. I'm living on GT Heroes because it was we just pan. But yeah, really good. So before they were pretty okay. Um, now they're actually really good and solid. Again, links are gonna suck. Categories are gonna be pretty okay, but links are gonna just massively suck though. So again they should just give themselves key, in my opinion. That would help them oh yeah they do. But um okay they do I feel weird for, for that. Um no, they don't, no, I'm only with Goku. Yeah, so you're gonna kinda have to limit yourself a little bit with Goku family allies. Which you have one because the 8-bit Goku on the team, so if you're doing the B pan, if you're doing the, like, the B pan, use the egg, but. <laughs> I think I have to start link leveling grinding some of those characters up, so I can probably get that team done probably now before it comes off Global. Even though it should be at the same time as Global, maybe for part 2 they can get it. I don't know how I get to it, but whatever. Um, Trust of course, uh, he supports his category key 3 with. um. He's 77% with um, youth, and of course he does AGL. Again, they all have the same little skill, just they all have different categories. Like, um, New Gray, Sam, and Trunks does, you know, youth and stuff like that, and he does AGL. Uh, I really defense, supreme damage, to, um, lowers defense, good. Uh, attack defense plus, that didn't really, that really didn't damage much. He does get a super attack early, though, at um, 9 key, so, good. Attack defense plus 90%, plus additional attack plus 7%, up to a chance of 77, or up to 77, and a chance to perform a crit up to 7%, to 49% now, with the chance of performing and launches. Uh, performed launches an additional attack with three or more key spheres obtained, which is kind of a new core right there a little bit. Um, launches an additional attack um, with five or more key spheres. Oh, okay, it's like PyCon a little bit. Oh god, we need a certain amount of key spheres to do this or that. Performs a critical with seven or more key spheres obtained, recovers, H recovers HP with candy. So, I guess it would be kind of her event chance with candy. So, uh, and make sure to do it. if you get if you die, it means you probably got to wait until a week to do it again. Oh god. That's yeah, it's gonna be really good. Really I mean, because Global, they could just easily give these guys easy A's and stuff like that, but I don't know why they didn't. They, all the stuff shit came from Global as well. You know, give us another LR easy A. I don't know. We don't have all easy A's already ready. Just, you see, these guys on Global, it's all you gotta do. You don't really need to do them. Just stupid. Now we wait all the way until November to do it. Yeah. But yeah, um, Southern Trunk seems really, really broken. Again, what we did before, just it's up a little bit more though, so they made him really pretty insane, so. Yeah, Trunks seems really insane. Crit and digital attack. He was already good before, and it made him really good. So, with Pan, she got her easy A finally. After 10,000 years, whoop, um, her leader skill recovers 5,555 um, 5, um, HP per key um, pure. Um, no, uh, okay, let me read that again. <clears throat> Recovers 5,505 5, 5, HP per key sphere obtained of characters, um, character type uh, ob obtained. Um, the colossal of uh, her super attack now does colossal damage with a medium chance of stunning the enemy. Her ultra super attack does um, really raise attack for one turn, colossal damage with a medium chance of stunning. Her new passive does, of course, um, her outer skills and I think outer skills and transformation conditions don't change. It'd be cool that it both at least 45 or you know 55%, so 77. Otherwise, she probably would have had the best active skill in the game because that 33% is actually really good for only just one turn, really good, and it can be activated for um, you know, three and stuff like that. And three turns, so. Um, high chance of you know key three, um. Plus additional um, high chance of getting a key three again. Um, let's see, yeah, high chance of getting key three. Plus he has another chance of getting a high chance of key three. Um, to recover thirty three percent of death of death as health depth as health reduces damage by fifty five percent. Okay, that's indefinitely because before that used to be a chance. Now it doesn't definitely. Now it's actually really really good. Um, again, what you did before? Again, they really made they made that um, produce damage permanent. 
um, by 35 percent. That's basically King Yamal's rotation. This is actually really good because before it was a high chance, I think, the um, guard or whatever. They made that permanent great. That's all you had to do because everywhere, everything, everything else was he's pretty much the same. Keep it the same, don't change it, leave it. They did that, made her perfect. They made it update like what one or two things. That's it for ZLO Easy A. She didn't really need one, but that um, reduces damage for 55 percent. I've seen this a little bit. Uh, that did reduce the damage for 55 percent permanently is great. They should have kept that in the first place. So they did pretty good though. They did really well. So yeah, they're gonna end the video here for sure though. All the easy A's, they're all good. Um, they're all great and all some of the cool stuff like that, of course. So yeah, lots of new easy A's, not lots of new units, lots of new stuff, of course. So yeah, we're all getting enough on BPM right here. So yeah, really good though. Again, they didn't change it that much. Really, really good. So yeah, see you guys later though. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day. Great life. Oh, good joke again though. Make sure you stay safe. Wash your hands. God bless. I'll be every time. I'll put in my matches and toilet paper every day. I'm spreading right now. Think about, what do you guys think about all this new stuff? Did you like it? Did you hate it? I'm finally glad I got this video out and done. Hopefully I'll get out as soon as I can. I just, you know, got, um, now that I'm busy, it's just now I'll finally get some free time to do some recordings. I'm probably going to record Vegeta Doku Fest event right now on mobile. So, yeah, my phone. I'm just going to so. See you guys later though again, though. Peace out.